Hey, what's going on, everybody? Criminal Justice here. Thank you for tuning in today. And we're finally going to start the story mode of Shadow the Tomb Raider. I apologize, everyone. I've, I've been sick. Uh, my voice is kind of congested sounding, you know. Uh, so I do apologize for that. But, uh, you know, still got to make them videos just like, you know, when you're sick and you, and you got a job, you got to get up and go to work. Or when you're sick and you got kids, you got to get them take care of them. No matter if you're sick or not, it's got to get done. Anyway, guys and girls, I'm here. And I'm glad y'all tuned in. God bless you guys. God bless America. God bless our troops that's fighting for our freedom every day. Let's get this game started, y'all. Let's do it. I hope y'all are having a good week so far. I hope y'all are enjoying my videos. I do apologize the last couple days. I've had a couple late posts. Um, I had some technical difficulties uh, with my internet. But I think I've got them all sorted out. And uh, plus, you know, I've been sick and stuff. So, and I've had, um, I've had a lot of things going on. But I do sincerely apologize. I appreciate y'all being patient with me. And waiting for the next video. Because I am uh, posting seven days a week now. So here we go. Shadow the Tomb Raider was created by a diverse and talented team comprised of multiple genders, backgrounds, ethnicities, religious beliefs, and personalities. Although the game is not based on real life events and represents a work of fiction, it was developed in conjunction with a historian and cultural consultants. Okay, I didn't get time to read all that. Anyway, you guys get the point. <laughs> So, for our friend Mike Sherlock. So, I started a whole new game. I haven't gotten very far in the game myself. I've only did like 8% completion of the game. But I started, I started a brand new game just for you guys and gals. So, I really, really hope that y'all are going to enjoy this. Because so far, it's been amazing. Uh-oh, here we go. She's always getting hurt. Man, always. Shit. Oh, you guys, y'all are gonna love this part. Do it's so intense too. Just a little stuck. Uh, a rock pin my leg. Don't move. I'll get help. No, I'm right on Trinity's tail. I don't want to attract attention. I'm on my way. I won't be long. Yeah, we're not going to be long, Jonah. Ooh. Ooh. That height. That height real bad. Come on, Laura. You can do it, girl. 
Oh man. Ooh, that looks like it hurts so bad. Gosh, get up. Quit being a weak one. Jeez, just do it. Check out that cool medallion on her neck. It's pretty cool. Here we go, y'all. I am now in control of Laura. I'm climbing. Yeah, this game is cool when you're when you're sitting in the dark playing with your headphones on and and uh, it just it's more intense like this especially this part right here is really intense for me. Let's see, I'm I'm controlling it right now, so the game is actually we on we on like Donkey Kong. Get up, Laura! Gosh. Oh, that is the old handy axe. Just gotta bandage yourself up. Cause she's a weenie. Get up, you and your peg leg. Look like he looked like that person died screaming. Go. I'm out. Be careful. The way into the site is full of traps. Trinity's not done with it yet. They're protecting something. Six right, weeks. See. And still no solid lead. Let's see here. Yeah. Here we go. But I talked to some people in town. And they're excited. There's a VIP coming to the day of the dead. Name's Dominguez. Look into it. Keep climbing, Lord. Come on, girl. Get up there. Alright, we got it. Come on, get up there. Jesus. Jonah, I made it. I'm on my way in. Almost there. Sorry I didn't wait. Be careful. Oh, gosh. Y'all, look at that. Oh, yeah, I'm picking up just a slight bit of tad, tad of lag, so I apologize for this. Let me fix this real quick. Sorry about that, y'all. Okay, we're good to go. I think it's cool that they put the uh, Shadow of the Tomb Raider around the edge of it, the border. I think it's pretty cool how they've done that. Which you can take it off, but... I actually forgot to take that off. I didn't mean to leave it on. Uh oh. That does not look good. Percent complete zero. Laura! Oh, get a load of this place. Yeah, man. Guess all that research paid off. What's up, Jonah? You know what Trinity's after. My dude. Yeah, they really didn't want us in here. I'm glad we followed your father's notes. What are those around his neck? I saw where the passage are those what I think they are? Please tell me those are not what I think they are. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. I'll quit being a pervert. This description is some sort of riddle. Pink fish. Pink fish. Silver crowned mountain. That thing is pretty amazing looking. It was damaged, perhaps intentionally. Perhaps intentionally. They usually just destroy everything. 
And no, I think the damage is older. But who would have tampered with it? Uh oh. There it is. Laura. Uh oh. You gotta get her. Dude, she don't give up for nothing, bro. She wants to get something, she gets it. Oh, that was such a dramatic fall. Drag me out, I'd still be in there taking pictures. Get up, both of you. Don't know if you'd be doing much. Hey, you want to freshen up? I think they're secretly like. Dr. Dominguez is supposed to be there now. I think they're secretly together behind closed doors. Pinkfish, Silver Crown Mountains, I'll look into it. By the way, this cafe is supposed to have really good food. I know the chef. Yeah, I'm not very hungry. <laughs> After all of that, I'm sorry. All right, y'all. Here we go. Excuse me, I gotta get me a drink. Sorry about that. Mountain Dew talking to me. There he is. Anything new on Dr. Dominguez? Not much. He's leading a few Trinity digs in the area. My father mentioned him in his journal more than once. Still after Trinity. Just like Rise of the Tomb Raider. Big help to the town. So how's your leg? Try to look. The riddle. Its directions. To find the hidden city, go south along the shore until you find the pink fish. I, I found something for that. It's pink dolphins. Found only in the... Uh. It goes on. Um, That's then what I chase think about the it. heart of the serpent to the silver crowned mountain. Look at this. Who cares? It's the constellation Hydra, the serpent. This star is the heart. It's set in the southwest. It's set in the southwest. It's from the Amazon River. Brazil. Peru. Peru? Okay. Um, this date from the ruins, see? If you look closely, it is damaged. This number looks like a Maya 13. But what if it's really an 8? With procession, it... What? Uh, procession. The Earth tilts, so over time, these stars appear in a different place in the horizon. Important if you're navigating by the night sky. Okay. In the Maya calendar, that's a 2,000-year difference. Back then, the heart of the sun wow. was directly to the west. So, that's, that's why amazing. it's amazing. Trinity has been looking in the wrong place. Exactly. Yep. We need to look for the Silver Crowned Mountain in Peru. I knew that in, last, in the last something uh, about, uh, game. Key. Almost said movie, you guys. <laughs> They seem so real, though, you know what I mean? We found it. Yes. Show me. You heard that too, right? Let's see where he goes. Wait, hold on. Trinity's watching this place. Let's try to blend it. Yeah, put on your mask. So I don't know how many of y'all actually, uh... I heard they brought in play the Tomb Raider games I want to avoid what but uh, if you do you know let me know what your favorite Tomb Raider game is in the comments below must know what the other you know tell me which ones you so played and which ones your favorite and uh, comment it for me you can't be far. and a like would be great you know a like would be good yeah. too on my video that would help me out a lot Let's look around. I would really appreciate it Someone you know, must know something. I always appreciate you guys and gals hey, Sammy. How's it going? in the shadows Excuse me. Maybe I could light one for my mother. All right, I don't. Really used to crowds. You'd rather storm guards or the death. Okay, all right. Oh, no, this is fine. Jonah, he's at the gate. He's at the gate. Lore looks 
looks so weird with that mask on. Find another way over the wall. She looks like she has a massive overbite with that mask on. Hey, fellas, how you doing? Good. Looks like she could okay. chew corn on the cob through a picket fence. For real though, she does, like she has an overbite with it on. Like her, 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 her. Like Bugs Bunny or something. God, she looks creepy in that thing. That was a good distraction, Jonah. Way to go, buddy. That was a great distraction, my man. Way to go, my dude. Jonah, I'm in. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Coming through. Ugh, look at her. Let's see where we gotta go. Okay, we gotta go over here. Can she not like sprint at least like a little bit or walk a little faster? No one questions your leadership of the organization. Oh, well, those like memorials, like. Yes, uh, sir. Oh, yeah, it's a candlelight ceremony for uh, dead loved ones, I guess, Jonah, is what it is. Dominguez is not just the leader of the cell. I think he's the leader of Trinity. I guess. I don't know, unless it's some kind of cult. Laura. Yeah, yeah, I heard you. Yeah, I heard you, Jonah. That'd be cool if I go. Whoa, dude. Watch it, my man. My fault. I'm gonna run to this person too. Excuse me. Move. Look at this guy's mask. Look at him. I'm gonna name him Bozo. What's up, Bozo? All these people wearing these creepy masks, like some kind of cult or something's weird in here. Someone set off a trap at the first sight. We think it was Croft. Wait. What's wrong? I want confirmation. No more kissing. She's eavesdropping. I'll make sure we get visual confirmation. Jonah, they might have noticed me. I'll try the back alley. Yeah. Let's try the back alley. Look at this. Look at these places, man. I'll lit up candles and skulls. Yeah, this is definitely some kind of cult or something. Oh, it's creepy. I have some pretty wicked dreams about cults. Really bad dreams about cults. Dominguez wants confirmation crop this year. You have the photo. Female, Caucasian, early 20s. You got that? Yeah. Good. They'll find her. Good. I don't want anyone getting in there. Well, if she's in her early 20s now, then how old was she when the very first Tomb Raider came out on PS1? Like, what was she, like a teenager? No. She had to have been a child. Right. Well, tell me what to do, boy. I'll pull my pistol and bust the cap in you, boy. Shoot that mask right off your face. Don't worry. Go. Hey. The readings at the site are unlike anything we've ever seen. Uh, I guess I'm supposed to keep going this way, yeah. This is it. Can she draw a gun or anything yet? No, she can't. Of course not. Jeez Louise. Jonah, they've entered the dig site. It's fenced off and there's a guard at the gate. I'll the dig the site, all right. I found a good spot. I'll watch the perimeter. All right.
objectives are highlighted in survival instincts. Oh, I know that. Okay, now now we can run a little bit. Here we go. In Laura Croft mode now, baby. How <laughs> are Come on, Laura, hurry up. There's got to be more to these ruins. A Maya pyramid inside some sort of cave. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh-oh. What we got going on? In the shadows. Alright, well I hope y'all enjoyed the video today. Thank y'all for tuning in and stopping by. I appreciate the views, the love, and support. And until next time, guys and gals, take care, God bless, and peace out.